we're going to go and bring Fireball to the park once again because she was so exhausted last night that we were very happy. The emergency barking system seemed to be shut down last night and after today's trip to the park the emergency barking system may be shut down for the next couple of days. And if you have a dog, everyone's familiar with what the emergency barking system is. Somebody comes up on your porch, or if somebody walks by a house, or if a bird flies over the town that sets off the emergency barking system. So join us on another day. Where are we going? Oh, to the state park. Welcome to my world. Being nice to the dog. Day 27. All right, take your snoot and one step back. There you go, very good. We're arguing about whether the command to get, for Fireball to get out of the front seat of the car should be back or snoot back. Since she doesn't respond to any command anyway, my position is that changing it to snoot back. Well, I don't know any dog that would ever Ever answer to your commands. You can see that most of my good ideas are poo pooed immediately. All right, snoot back. There, see, see how well that worked? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yesterday, when Fireball was out here, we got her home and she was stiff. So today, we're trying to have her stretch before we do Bella, the throw the ball here. and get it, bring it back routine. Good girl. Good. Okay, ready? Well, now I think you can see that we have the rolling in the dirt portion. This is just warming up, however, because it's overheated. when she really rolls in dirt, she's rolling on the ball. She's rolling on the grass right now, maybe on the ball, but in a few minutes she'll be rolling in mud. That portion of our trip won't be over until she's rolled in a substantial no. amount of mud. But we are now going on the walk away, yell at the dog, have her ignore everything we say, and then get mad at her portion of the route of the trip. Stella. Fireball is an expert at ignoring human commands, which we probably have a demonstration of in a few minutes. So far, our ignoring all human commands portion of our trip is going very well. Fireball has not obeyed one thing, not one thing that we, te we said here. to him. I'm suspicious that maybe Fireball was born in Canada and perhaps we should be using French commands. But I don't know how to say snoot away in French, so that's a problem. Well, this ought to be good. Getting a dog that doesn't listen to one word we say next to a body of ice cold water. I can't wait to see what happens. It seems that common sense has prevailed and we are not going to be taking Fireball down to the beach. We're going to take him back to the car. He looks sufficiently tired. Maybe bring him home. Where we can dust him off, tidy him up, and get him ready to laze around the house like he did yesterday. I hear that guy, that was good. What? She waited for me to say it's okay to say hello to him. That was good girl. My family comes from a long line of owning dogs who have attended a beating in school, but there is no actual behavioral evidence of it other than a certificate that they got when they completed it, so-called completed it. Bella. So Bella. Fireball is not very obedient. Let's Come put it that here. way. That is one dirty dog. One muddy dog. Okay, Bella, inside. In Uncle Bill's car. Come on, babe. Yeah, great. <laughs> well, I'm sitting here in the car with Fireball, as you can see. And after her or his rolling in the mud or the water or the grass or whatever it was at the state park 
I now have the beautiful aroma of wet dog all over the car. My sister is in has gone shopping for groceries, so I thought I would stay here and watch Fireball while she was in the store. And to be honest with you, I'd just rather not go shopping. So I'm not really sure which is worse though. Shopping for groceries or sitting in the car with a wet dog. Maybe you could leave a note in the comments and tell me which you think is worse. Okay, that's our trip to the state park. Fireball is sufficiently covered with mud. He manages to ignore almost every, almost every command we gave hey, him. We went, she went walking, she was off leash, and she's back in the car with us. In one piece, so which... I think we did good. Yeah, I think we did more work than she did, Mary. But anyway, she that's met, it met for two new friends. our Fireball Weekend. Thanks for watching. Hopefully next weekend I'll have something a little bit more interesting. I think Fireball is going into outer space next weekend, so stay tuned. Fireball. Look at the camera. It's very hard to film, Fireball. One of the things I've noticed about animals and babies especially is that they are absolutely terrible actors. Stella, come here.